the snail ride. I'm a dude. I'm like, how bad could it be? Like a fucking hockey glove. Like a fucking 50... Three. Every time I have sex with her, I realize I am fucking the oldest lady I've ever fucked. And I like it. <laughs> fucking an old lady is like drinking scotch. It's not meant for the young boys. You. <laughs> Stick with your fireball, boys. I'll take the scotch. Full-bodied, smoky, complex. What do you say to a 20-year-old after you fuck her? You can play on your iPad for 15 minutes. <laughs> Give me an old lady who takes me to the doctor. <laughs> she went to the doctor with me. This is old people shit. She goes, I don't think he's saying what you think he's saying. And then she went, I used to be able to work my doctor. So if I got him to laugh, he'd forget what we were talking about. He was like, what have you been doing to lose weight? And I was like, well, I switched the scale to kilograms. <laughs> She's like, that's not funny. I go, bitch, this is how I get pills. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> 53 and the doctor put me on testosterone and secret time i'm going to tell you this she's on testosterone also oh! yeah and progesterone i don't know medically what it does i can just tell you from my perspective it turned her into a whore she <laughs> fucking wild bro what she called me up one night she goes you won't have phone sex she has never offered this in 20 years of marriage i was like absolutely she goes well call me when you get to your tour bus i sprinted to my tour bus with a hard dick man you know how difficult that is i don't know how rapists do it and then i got there and i had the pleasure of having phone sex with a 53-year-old woman who's not familiar with all the angles of porn that we know as guys. <laughs> she had it on the side, propped up on a pillow. I'm seeing oh. side tit, little nip, and a ceiling fan. <laughs> and you gotta, you gotta massage it. You can't tell her what you're thinking. Like, crisscross applesauce, bitch, I wanna see pussy. <laughs> you gotta be gentle and be like, maybe if you put it on your heel, I can get a good angle of your front bottoms. <laughs> she just goes, you won't look at my titty cheek? I'm like, that's not what I said. <laughs> you won't look at my cooter? I'm like, stop talking. Let's not talk during this. <laughs> she goes, I know what you want to watch. You want to watch me butter my bread. I'm like, slow down, Dolly Parton. <laughs> then she started buttering bread. I was like, yeah, butter your fucking bread. Whatever you call it in Pigeon Forge, do that shit. <laughs> Then she said to me, well, wait, I want to watch you. I was like, that's not how this works. I jack off down here on the DL. You got my face so you know when I'm jack. I'm not going to fucking jack off. And then I had to prop the phone up three feet from me on the bed. The most disgusting angle. To And then apparently there's a new feature on iPhone. I don't know if you've seen this, but if you get the thumbs up, it just gives you a thumbs up. No. And if you put the head of my dick in my hand, it looks a lot like a thumbs up. I'm just hammering the screen unknowingly. Goosh, goosh, goosh. Both of us are like, fuck, are people watching us? Are we watching this? I was like, I don't know. I didn't think anyone's going to like this Gilbert Grape sex tape, but fuck it. Just Mama and Arnie coming at it. I, she, she buttered her bread and I'm churning the butter, baby. I have my fucking readers on. Do you know how embarrassing that would have been? To get caught live streaming jerking off with fucking readers? I had to get readers. We had an incident. We, we were taking George to college. A travel agent texted me and said, hey, I got two trucks on hold, an Armada and an Escalade. Which one do you want? Now, I'm unfamiliar with an Armada. So I just wrote back, I want the bigger truck. No readers. Did you know the letter B on a keyboard is right next to the letter N? Oh, no. I said a hate crime to a woman named Felicia. Panic down my fucking spine. Luckily, she's cool. She's like, Escalator it is. <laughs> I don't text the word bigger at all. It's big up. Now, 
Here's the best thing. She got me readers. She got me readers. She got me. And I look cute as fuck in readers. Put them on. She goes, you look cute in them glasses, boy. I was like, suck this dick, bitch. <laughs> and she came in to give me a kiss. And I realized I haven't seen this woman in high death in 10 fucking years. I stepped on those glasses and saved my marriage. Here's the deal. No, fuck you. I love her. I love her. I do fucking love her. I do. If she cheated on me, I'd murder her. That's love, right? Yeah. Don't worry. I killed my daughters, too. I'm not going to be a single parent. <laughs> Jesus. I get $2 million if she dies. Isn't that wild? How are you supposed to fake being sad? <laughs> At a funeral, when you know you have a boat showing up. <laughs> Two million. We did the DNR stuff. You ever do that? Do not resuscitate. They fucking horrible. Guy says, just met the guy. In the unlikely event, something horrible happens to you when you're put on life support. Leanne, what would you like to happen? Fucking redneck just goes, pull the plug. <laughs> pull the plug. I want you to start over. Life goes home. I want you to find happiness. You and the girl. I was like, cool. <laughs>